Hey, Star Wars Vintage Dude here. Hope you're fantastic. Hope you're great. Uh, totally changing things up a little bit here. Um, as I open up boxes, I also am acquiring some new stuff. So uh, I want to give some shout outs to some people that I've been buying stuff from to expand my collection. Let's get to it. I'm going to cut this thing open right now. Hopefully I don't slice my finger open or cut the uh, action figures up themselves. So I do order from time to time some different things. Um, I still collect the uh, vintage collection in honor of the old Kenner classics. And here we have, this is from uh, Jeffrey Scott, 1984, shout out to you. We've got the Mandalorian uh, R5-D4. This is such a great figure, that great surprise appearance in the show, the Mandalorian. Of course, we've got the back with the brand new card back design. Um, and we know that's one of our favorite astromechs from all the way back from uh, A New Hope, right? This R5 unit has a bad motivator. All right, here is Vintage Collection 265. Still got that uh, transition back here from the old school where they just kind of had that vintage checklist, kind of like the old uh, Empire and uh, 21 backs. But uh, you know what? <sighs> to be honest, between the two, I really dig the uh, card back from the Vintage Collection series. It's one of the big draws that I had. I have not played this video game. It's from Star Wars Jedi Survivor, Cal Castes. I assume he is the protagonist in the video game. Um, and next we have uh, Star Wars Rogue One. This is VC302, director Orson Krennic. This is from uh, <clears throat> Rogue One and He's got his Empire uh, uniform on, which is the white. It's fantastic. And let's see, we have one more action figure in this. Jeffrey Scott, uh, 1984. Give you a shout out, sir. A beautiful pack job. Items are great condition here. Um, no crush bubbles or anything like that, which is so hard to get these days. Either they're sent to you from Amazon or Target or Walmart, just simply crushed. And it's not even worth buying at a brick and mortar store anymore. Or uh, there's nothing left at the brick and store, brick and mortar stores. Um, they're filled with uh, Ahsoka figures and stuff. So I want to give Jeffrey Scott 1984 a shout out. And uh, may the force be with you guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. And rock on and keep collecting the vintage collection. And Star Wars Vintage Dude out.